My network, good to be back again. This evening is going to be a time of reflect, kind of reflection, you know. So many things have been happening back in Nigeria, which we always see on the videos online. So, so painful what we'll be saying. Um, just a reflection, just for the leaders. Most people now, most of the leaders, the governors and the president, just have a few months to few months before they will leave the power. Just uh, this is a question for them. When you leave, when you leave the office, what will be your legacy? What are you going to leave behind? What are we going to remember you for? What you've done, what you did, the good or the bad. Is it for good or for bad? Is it acquiring properties or you, you help with the needy or the, in education, you make sure there was good, um, you did your best in education, in health sector, in infrastructure, in, in all around, what to be a legacy? This is a question for everyone to answer. Because power come, power go, that is how it is, man. You would think you are right now you're on top. No, power come, power go. Before you know it, it's it's over. Four years is just like it's, it's just like a choice. It's just like a trickle of, of, of an eye. Before you know it, it's over. So what are you going to remember for? That is the truth. So I will say, in these few months you you have left. Can you make amends? Can you just do the best out of it up? Can you just do the best and make sure you leave at least <laughs> something behind that people, people will remember you, remember you for? Come on, come on, come on, go. That, that is how it is, man. I was it to San Jose some time ago. He said, then some years ago, people had drunk up. Drop with power. They were doing what they think is it was good for them. But before you know it now, in a few months' time, they'll be out of power. That is how it goes. Because it's it's so pathetic what is happening right now in Nigeria. I see videos, seeing two naked different videos, two people make naked the banking hall. Because man, the life is unbearable. They have money in the bank, but they cannot withdraw it. I mean, when I saw another video, the banks were holding the new Naira notes. I don't understand. You hold for you hold for now. You hold the new Naira notes. I always say all these things we are passing through in Nigeria is they are all self-made, self-made punishment, self-made um, scarcity. It's all self-made. If we do things right. Will get it right, but greediness will not allow people to do it. I mean, to do the right thing. Too bad, people are frustrated. You know, one of the video everywhere in Nigeria is like for survival, survival of the fittest, and the APC government they are campaigning. They should be apologizing for what they did. What they've done to the Nigeria people, they should be apologizing. As I'm just talking, I mean, uh, Obi was in Open State today. I will be playing the video as I'm talking, so I, I don't. Of the, of the Royal Highness, um, you know, to campaign, Mamo crowd, man. Our card, man. So we really need a change. We need a change. As I was saying, all these things, they are all self made. I post here. Let me, let's, it, let's it on him first. Let's, let's it on him. Let me post here. No, I don't think okay, not yet. So, as I was saying, <clears throat> All these things are all the all man made. The suffering the people have in Nigeria, they are all man made. And we, they, they, we don't 
We don't deserve. We don't deserve that. Okay, it's, it's, it's talking on. Let me let's please. Ibrahim, the most secure system. I would not like the country because the country today is so divided. And that is our commitment number one. Number two is to ensure that the government, this country, is served by the rule of law. It must be law and order. Has a crowd there, you know. Obi is a man of the people. He's a movement, man. The divine movement. If I say divine, I mean divine. So nobody can stop it. We are here to change everything that is going on. We have to change everything that's going on. Because what is happening right in Nigeria is not good. It's not the best for our country. We need to change. We need to change it. Okay, people are suffering. As I was saying, a, a bank was, I'm sure they are very many, but just what one video I saw, holding new notes. Why? Why? The, the Nigeria, they hold for it. They hold new, new notes again. But they are not holding everything good for people to suffer. Yeah, let's, I mean, I mean, just a moment. Let's hear him. In Nigeria is where you have you don't have unemployment. Every third in Nigeria, everybody suffering. When they had access strike, there's no strike that was excluded. Everybody was included. But when they come to the election, they start dividing you. And you're listening to them. It will not depend on religion. No religion buys bread cheaper. No religion was excluded. Do not strike. Although things will affect your parents, when they hold pension and gratuity, they do not do it according to religious law. They owe everybody. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 